A couple of months ago, Audacity was bought by a company, and in the latest release of Audacity, they implemented features to actually obtain and distribute information. I made a video not that long ago recommending Audacity as a free open source software for people who want to edit audio, and I had some people bring that up for me. Do you want to know how to turn that off and still be able to use the software completely perfect without any issues whatsoever? Stay tuned to the video. How's it going everyone? Hope you all have a fantastic day. My name is Asynchro and today I'm bringing you a very quick, convenient guide to teach you guys how to stop Audacity from tracking any of your information. On Audacity's privacy notice, you can actually see some of the data that they're actually tracking of you. Keeping in mind that some of the information that Audacity is collecting is information that several apps that you probably already have installed on your PC are already doing it. So it's nothing new, but I can also understand that you guys just want your privacy. To stop Audacity from taking any information from your computer, all you have to do is change one setting on your firewall to stop it completely, and that's it. First, click on your Windows button at the bottom and type Windows Defender Firewall. Once Windows Defender Firewall pops up, click on Advanced Settings. A new window will appear. On the top left, click on Outbound Rules, and then make your way to the button that says new rule. Once the new window appears, click on program and then hit next. On the next page, select this program path and then click browse. Look for your Audacity installation folder and select audacity.exe. Hit next and on the next window, you wanna click block the connection. And on the final page, you should see three checkboxes. Make sure all of them are ticked and then hit next. Give it a name or description of choice or just call it Audacity and hit finish. And it's that simple. You successfully set up your firewall to stop Audacity from collecting any of your information. Despite Audacity having a information collection feature added to it, the tool still remains open source and it still remains an amazing piece of software for anyone that needs to work on audio. And that's all for the video. Thank you so much everybody for watching. If you guys have any questions and you need any help with anything, come check us out on Twitch. I stream Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays starting at 4 p.m. Australia Western Standard Time. Hope to see you there. For now, catch y'all later.